driven ashore six miles north of Land's End, a 5,000-ton Liberian ship, Liberty, lies the helpless victim of raging storms. Eight miles off Land's End stands that sturdy sentinel, the Wolfrock Lighthouse, now cut off for nearly a month. Men of the Trinity House vessel Satellite pack a container with overdue Christmas mail for the maroon keepers, which a small boat sets off to deliver. From the lighthouse flies a homemade kite used by the keepers for fishing. This kite is picked up by the launch and with difficulty the Christmas mail for the keepers is attached. The first contact with Wolfrock for 26 days is about to be made. Now comes the much more difficult task of sending in much needed provisions. A rocket is fired with line attached from the lighthouse and lands across the small boat. The provisions, made up into a bundle, are fixed to the line. And very soon that bundle's on the way and fresh food once again appears on the Wolfrock menu. But turbulent seas still prevent the three men from ending their lonely vigil for a well-earned rest ashore one of winter's many hardships for the men who keep watch around Britain's coasts. <laughs> 